you amazing person. I hope you're doing fantastic. In today's video, I'm going to give you some advice about that crush that you have. In today's video, I have 10 signs of an unhealthy crush. Now, I know what it's like. You can be obsessed with someone, but being obsessed is not healthy and it's not a good thing. So in this video, you are going to find out all you need to know whether you are in an unhealthy relationship with someone that doesn't have the same feeling for you. Let's roll. You compulsively hang out with them even when you know you're too busy. If you find yourself choosing to hang out with your crush rather than finishing your important work, projects, homework, whatever it may be, and then you feel terrible about it the next day, you may be addicted to the relationship and that isn't a good thing. You run into them on purpose. You know where he or she likes to go for coffee, so you make that conscious effort and start going there instead of your actual favorite place so that you can accidentally bump into this person. You're trying to break them up. If the person that you are crushing on already has a partner, the right thing to do is just leave them alone. Not try to badmouth this person or try to say that thing that she did or he did was terrible. You need to break up with them. You feel depressed when they're gone. Do you find that you can no longer find enjoyment in things alone like you used to do? You've tried to change who you are just to get their attention. Now remember, you shouldn't be ever trying to change your amazing perfect self just to get someone's attention. If they haven't already noticed you for who you are, then they are not worth your time. You think they are literally flawless. You should accept that nobody is perfect. And if they are behaving inappropriately, you shouldn't be letting that slide. A very common thing is I see lots of people who are obsessed with their crush and their crush can be treating them poorly as friends and they're just putting up with it because they're just so obsessed. You are not together, but you're not interested in anybody else. If the person that you're currently crushing on isn't into you, you shouldn't be waiting around for them to change your mind. You need to get up and find someone who wants you right now for who you are. Now this one's very common, but if you do this all the time, it can be very unhealthy. You daydream about conversations that are just not going to happen. I hate to break it to you, but if you are focusing on loving someone from afar and you aren't able to get out of this imaginary world that you have created, it's probably time to schedule some real life time with real people. Your social media stalking is getting out of hand. Now it's okay to peek at someone's Instagram, we all do it, but if you find you're looking at previous partners' pages too, then you definitely have gone too far. You find yourself neglecting other people in your life. Obviously you only have so much time in the day, so you need to make yourself available to other people. However, if you seem to be spending no time with your friends or your family and dropping everything to hang out with your crush, this is not healthy at all. Like I said guys, if you are in a situation right now where this person that you are crushing on isn't interested in you and hasn't taken notice in how amazing you are, you need to stop it, go find somebody else because there will be someone out there right now that's probably maybe even crushing on you and you haven't noticed but they are very very healthy in how they approach the whole stalking on instagram thing have an amazing day and i will see you in the next video my name's anna remember give me a thumbs up so i know that you enjoy these videos and subscribe to the channel it will make my day see you soon